Hello, I'm just going to show how to get into the Surface 3 BIOS because the information on the Microsoft website seems to be outdated. So basically what you have to do is hold down the volume up button like this and then press and release the power button. Keep the volume up button pressed the whole time as it's booting up. On the Microsoft website it says to let go once the Surface logo appears but this doesn't work with the Surface Book 3, you have to keep it held down the whole time. And basically once you're in the BIOS, you can change uh, all your BIOS settings, so like boot configuration and so on. Um, by the way, the trackpad doesn't um, doesn't work with all the, all the buttons for some reason, for example. See, the trackpad doesn't work once you click on something, but the touchscreen does still work most of the time sometimes there we go so it's uh, pretty unresponsive for some reason but uh, yeah so basically uh, one thing you can do that you might want might be interested in is enabling this battery limit for example if it's plugged in all the time but um, basically so I have this turned on but this uh, only works on the tablet portion so that the uh, surface uh, dock the surface base the battery will still charge to 100% and the battery limit doesn't make any difference with that so it's uh, kind of useless but uh, it's just for the tablet but basically um, you're still going to be wearing out the battery on the surface dock so I'm just going to turn this off because I actually want to use the tablet now oh, there we go um, so yeah that's basically it and then you can exit here and uh, restart the surface so um, once the surface is booted up you can just see here on the uh, battery limit now it's charging but if you look here you see that the the main battery of the tablet is limited but the surface dock battery still charges to 100% so basically the battery hold only works on the surface tablet portion it's really not very useful but there you go thanks for watching goodbye